Hi and welcome to my channel. It's Rebecca, also known as a 4 kids at 147 and I've got some more items to share with you from fan cells. Um, so let's start with, let's start small because um, then I've got a hope of finding somewhere to put them <laughs> um, once I've unboxed them before I show them all at the end. So this first one, oh, this looks to be a special diamond painting and it is, oh, that's pretty. I think this might be one that fan cells have chosen, though I'm not objecting. Um, they did send me a few that, that they've made the choice this time, as well as ones that I chose. But I like that because they sort of know what it is. You know, some of the extra special sort of features on some of theirs. So you can see here we've got a huge amount sort of in the middle here of big black, big circles. So we need to find out what diamonds they will be. Um, we get a basic toolkit, boat wax pen. And then while it's down as a 30 by 40, the actual canvas size on this one is 24 by just under 34. Um, we can sort of lift this cut of paper up and then put it down again with the, the diamond painting flatter and it does help. Um, or you can iron the backs of these. I've ironed the backs of these before. Oh, I've just seen what those big, big dots are for. To show you, look, it's roses. Um, so number four, yes it is. So those big black dots will actually get covered with roses. That's really pretty. So there's some around her feet and it's as though there's some in her hands. Um, we do have a couple of other sort of more special ones. We have um, some green. We have some stars in green and we have some stars in silver. And then we have sort of the pearl type looking white. And when I say pearl type, it's because they've not got the little facets on them. Um, but it is like an AB coating, but over a smooth. So we've got that in white and blue. And then we've got the crystals in a couple of shades of pink, some green, gold, purple, and pink. It's a bit hard to tell sometimes if there's more of the silver side showing um, than there is the other side, but all oh, that's pretty. And this is the part where I do like when sort of, you know, the seller chooses what to send because I would never have twigged that they had those little little roses on them. Um, and they're really nice when they when they appear on a painting. Um, so good choice from them. That one's sweet. That would look really nice in a bedroom. Um, we do get a standard toolkit with that one as well. And then number two. Let's have a look what we've we got in this one. Is this one that they picked or this one that I picked? And can I even remember if it's one that I picked? That is the question. Oh yes, I can remember. This is one that I picked. And we have the same error that we had last time. So, um, I did unbox this on a previous um, unboxing. And the picture is absolutely gorgeous. Love the picture. Um, it has 20 colours and they do have DMC numbers. Now, the diamond painting number is B378. But they keep sending with it diamonds for V378. So there's no real point in showing the colours for that because it's the wrong painting. Uh, there is no orange on this painting at all. Um, and there's no blue diamond in this packet, which is what this painting needs. So I will let them know um, that that is a problem. Um, I kind of feel like I've cheated you out of a, an unboxing item though. So let me just grab something else. So this is a little bit different. Uh, and we'll show you this instead of that painting. 
Um, but this is one of the storage items that I've seen on their site. Now, I do like my cases where it has the foam inserts for the bottles to slip into. However, if you've seen any of my unboxings, you may know that quite often I am moving bottles about and I'm de-kissing from one and I'm putting up from another. Um, so this, I thought, would be a good idea to have, you know, a nice, decent amount of spare bottles. Whether it be, you know, that I have a few extra that I maybe want to keep somewhere. Um, or yeah, or maybe I'll use it for storing ABs. I'm not sure. Um, but I like the fact that there's multiple bottles and I can always switch them about between my containers. It does come in a nice plastic storage kit and you can just use it straight from this. I mean, to be fair, Megan is currently doing a painting with, I think it's only got about 10 colours in it. Um, and she's just using the bottles loose. So she's not got them in a case or anything. She's just got them in a little basket. Um, and that would be nice for maybe some of the special diamond paintings. Maybe if you've got something that, you know, uses... Maybe you're doing a set of key rings. Maybe you're doing a set of three, four key rings and it only comes with five colours, but you don't want to do them all at once. Um, that's what I wanted these pots for, for sort of extra things that happen. Plus, it spares. If any of them get broke or damaged, I can switch them out. Um, but they're the same size as most of the other cases that I've got. The only real difference I find is, is that occasionally I will find a case has a slightly different style bottle. And it's not that they won't all interchange, it's that I'm fussy um, and I like them all to match. So um, this then gives me the option of basically another set of bottles. I can't quite remember how many came in this case, but I will pop the link down below for it um because i think this is this is ideal i say especially if you're doing something that's a lot smaller just take out however many you need and just pop them into you know a piece of tupperware will do it um just something that you have in the house already to contain it and you've still got the benefit of using the bottles um if you've not got a case that'll fit but if you need this many use this size case um, so hopefully that's something that will help some people I think they're going to come in really useful for me especially when me and Megan are constantly doing multiple pictures um, and then I do have the big one to unbox from this unboxing I say I will contact fan cells in regards to that other one um, it's just an error that's been made and I'm sure they'll fix it but I won't pop the link down below until I do confirm that it is fixed um, that's only because I don't want anybody else to have the same problem oh yes now I've seen somebody do this one um, I think it was on our Facebook group um, they've either done this one or similar I'd actually ordered it from fan cells before I saw it and as soon as I'd seen it done I was like oh, yes I'm so glad I've got this one coming um, so this is just two dragonflies with I believe there are angels among us and um, I like the clarity of the words now this is doesn't actually say what size it's supposed to be so tape measure um, the drill area is 39 the sort of canvas area is probably if I'm going by the lines it's about 44 and a half 45 uh, I think they're going to say it's a 45 by 45 but it's actually drill area is 40 by 39 and a half so nearly a 40 by 40 actual drill area um, it has 27 colours which is pretty amazing um, it does have 310 and a lot of it by the looks of this pack of diamonds here um, but this one is a square oh wow that is a lot of 310 okay you ready for this 
I'm seeing gorgeous colours there, but I'm seeing the whole thing wrapped in 310. So we're ready for the 310. If you don't like 310, this painting's not for you. So we have two, four, six, eight, ten. Ten lots of 310. Then we go into some nice colours. So there is quite low amounts of these which is sort of to be expected because it is only scattered around in the wings. Oh, that orange, there is not a lot at all. So that is number six, which is an X. So there is a tiny amount of it up here and there is a tiny amount of it down here and that's it. <laughs> only a little amount of diamonds. Uh, we have some browns, pinks, some greys. Um, there's quite a bit of shading that sort of goes on to give these little bits here that's quite nice. Um, then we have some greeny greys, browns, oh look at that turquoise, nice red, what's that number? 18, 3371, so we've got quite a bit of dark brown to go with blacks, but then we've got some purples, greys, so there is quite a bit of grey, as well as some more blues and a little bit of white. So yes, there is a lot of 310. If you're not keen on 310, it might not be the painting for you, but I think that is stunning. And I think sometimes it is the 310 that actually does make a picture pop. Um, it, it is that 310 that makes it stunning. Um, so sometimes we do just need to... We just need to do the 310 people to get the images like this. Um, but those butterflies have got, and there's quite a few. So I'm not sure if you can see. So in regards to the codes, there is the 310 outlining the, the dragonfly here and here. But then there is also, can you see all these other codes that are slightly lighter than 310 shades all the way around the outside? Of those dragonflies and that is what makes them lift gives them that shadow and that shading um, and the shading in that word at the bottom is gorgeous as well this not so much um, but it will stand out and you can read it which is the main thing and this looks really really nice when done so they're going to be the three items that I show you today so we've got that gorgeous painting we've got a nice special diamond painting with the beautiful roses and we've got some storage um, extra bottle storage which you can either use in this case or you can use separately say so I think my primary goal with these is to use them separate um, so if I'm doing the likes of this painting and I know I'm not going to be able to do it all at once or probably more likely the likes of key rings and stuff um, I'll tip them into these little pots um, and do them that way yes so I'll pop links to all of these down below but thank you so much for watching and I'll speak to you all again soon